Hello everybody, Sheep Vice here. Welcome back to Let's Play Uncharted Drake's Fortune. In the last episode, we made it to the library finally. So, let's go ahead and see if Sully's here. She worked in this little bar in the Philippines. Well, I hear him. <laughs> she had a smile that would melt your heart. Bro, I swear to God, she just as soon kill you as kiss you if she caught you stepping out. Just a wee bit of a thing. She couldn't have been much more than 411. I called her the spinner because <laughs> she you shut up, old man. You told us that one a dozen times already. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> of course I did. Memory is not what it used to be. What the hell's taking you so long anyway? Well, maybe you hadn't noticed, but most of these books are half rotten and written in Spanish. Yeah, we'll hurry it up. The boss is waiting on you. Hey! Up there! Ah, oh, crap. They spotted us. Crap. Well. That was a good time to save Sully. Uh, but this battle is somewhat easier than previous battles. Because now we have a huge height advantage. Although, even though it's easier, I'm still probably going to die. But that's okay. It's all a part of the process. I just want to, like, sneak up on this guy. Take. Ah, <laughs> that didn't work so good. I messed that up terribly. I was, I wanted to take that guy out pretty quickly because he was getting in my way. But he's focused on Elena right now, so there's not much I can. Oh, here he comes. Hello. Goodbye. And now you gotta be careful of the M79 and the deserts. Because they will all kill you very quickly if you're not careful. Well, I guess so will the other guys. Oh. <laughs> Alright, there's the M79 guy. Maybe I should try take him. Oh, cr yeah, I should definitely take him out. Get back. Maybe we can scoot. Up. Don't kill me, please. He's aiming. Okay, got rid of him. Now we just gotta get rid of the desert guys with the laser sight. I think I think these guys have helmets. See that these guys are enemies later in the game. So they have helmets, and I don't know. If I headshot him and he doesn't die, then they have helmets. I can't tell. Wait, that's bad. Let's not get that close. You know what? We're just gonna roll up to this one up here. It'll make things a bit easier. If there wasn't a guy shooting at me from behind. <sighs> Fine, we'll be... Okay, we gotta be more patient this time. Who was that? Anyway, he was up on the ledge. There's some. There's somebody else over there. <sighs> Dang. All that work for nothing. Jeez, man, it's so hard to hit anybody here because you're worried about so many different guys. Maybe I can just grenade. That was pretty bad. I was gonna try and grenade that guy down there, but I hit this base right here and it flung way up. Maybe I can get this group of people. We got one. <laughs> yeah. Oh dang, we got them 7-9 guy to worry about again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I even get that guy? Okay, I got that guy at least. But that uh, guy way off in the distance that killed me last time is annoying me. Okay, maybe this battle's not as easy as I remember it. Got a lot of stuff going on. Gotta watch out for. So let's 
Let's uh, take out that guy in the corner first then. Not the old, uh, uh. Jeez, Lena. Getting lots of attention. Grenades thrown at her from every which direction. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, I can't. I aim right. This guy's gonna kill me if I'm sitting right there. Wish he wasn't so far back. Oh, now you kill Melena. When I come all the way over here. Thanks. <laughs> Would've been nice if she could've done that before. So, let's just... Now we can sneak up on this guy. There we go. And yeah, we'll use it for a bit, why not? Even though I complain about it all the time. It's there. Could save some of our other ammo for later. Okay, where is everybody? They're all like in the center. <laughs> okay, here's one guy. Let's take him out. Or not? <laughs> he wasn't even flinching. That's pretty impressive, actually. If I got shot with a couple bullets, I'd be pretty a lot of pain. I wish I didn't shoot the wall. Okay, where is this guy? There he is. The railing is my way. No, let's just stand up. Back up. He moved right. Uh, there we go. Whew. Oh, man, it's about time you showed up. <laughs> well, you're looking awfully good for a course. I know. So you brought the girl after all, eh? The girl? Hey, if it wasn't for her, you wouldn't be getting rescued right now. If this is a rescue. What the hell does that mean? You gotta admit, Sully. This all looks a little shady. Yeah. I mean, you tipping those guys off. And miraculously showing up alive. Now, wait a goddamn minute. Roman had a contract out on me. I needed to buy some time. All right, stupid mistake. I didn't realize they'd try and track us. Sully, we would have been headed home with the treasure by now if you had just for once kept your mouth shut. And you might have thought of checking for a pulse before running off and leaving me for dead. There's so many other guys there, they would have killed us. Oh. None of that matters now. All right, so how is it you're standing here breathing and all, huh? <laughs> you are not going to believe this. Huh? <laughs> no way. <laughs> Old Francis took a bullet for you. Yeah. I thought this kind of thing only happened in the movies. Yeah, well, it still hurt like a son of a bitch, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I bet. Anyway, once they realized I wasn't dead, I convinced Roman that they would never find the treasure without me. So I've been trying to mislead him ever since. Huh. Waiting for you okay. To show up. Well, where are they now? So Sully has been on our side the whole time. Little red herring I sent him on on the other side of the monastery to get rid of him. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan. Drake had it all figured out. See, that's the symbol the Spanish used to mark their secret vaults. We saw that symbol earlier. Is or, no, right never mind. In this we saw something similar to find it. The but symbol, and we, we find, find the vault. vault. We have everything we need, right here. All the clues to take us right to the treasure. We can do this, kid. <laughs> all right, you boys aren't gonna get all chummy and leave the girl behind again, are you? <laughs> Don't even think about it, Sully. She's got a mean right hook. I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> okay, so now we've got There's more to a larger meets the eye. group. Sure of it. Hmm. Something about these statues. Okay, so now that we have Drake's journal back, we can do some more puzzle sort of things. And you can see that there are four images on the left, as well as um, there are signed directions on the right. So what we have to do with these statues, so you can see there's a big compass on the ground. Uh, it took me a while to find that compass the first time through. So let's start up here at the north. 
and we have this little angel statue thing. Now you can see his name is matched to the north, so we need to make him face okay. north. So now he's facing north, and we'll move over to the next statue. So this is an eagle looking thing. And that's John, I think, so he needs to be facing east. So we'll turn him around 180 like the other statue. And now we'll head over to the south side. We have a lion statue, which is Mark, it looks like. So he's facing west. Uh, for whatever reason, they put W for west. I don't know if probably some sort of language differences that I'm not aware of. Finally we got Luke who needs to be facing south. But, nope, turn it around. So once you have all the statues facing the right way, we can move on. You know I probably should have done more research before playing through this game. So I could actually explain stuff better. But I guess it's getting me to think about stuff I never really thought about before. Yeah, so this area is going to be pretty cutscene heavy. Sorry about that. Huh. What now? But we had a bunch of action in a lot of previous episodes. So every once in a while. If you have a bunch of cutscenes together, that's fine. I mean, they split them up. Plenty. You know, this looks familiar. The inverted torch leads to the land of the dead. Okay. We can see the picture of the torches are upside down. This one's right side up. So let's turn that around. And this one as well. Nothing too difficult. It takes a while to set in. <laughs> I was actually questioning whether I did that right or not. Wow. This looks promising. Here, let me see that. Yeah. Okay. You two sit tight. I'm gonna check things out. Whoa, wait, no. You're not going out there alone. Yeah, Roman's men are swarming all over this place. Yeah, and one person will make a lot less noise than three. Come mm -hmm. on, I'll be fine. And you guys will be safe here. They don't even know about this room. Okay, take this with you. Leave it on channel 13. They don't use that one. And keep us posted. All right, you got it. Close this thing back up. Yeah. Nate, be careful. <laughs> Come on. I always am. Ah! I did <laughs> not see that! Ah! Okay there, Nate. Hopefully he'll be more careful while he's wandering around here. Okay, land of the dead. Here we go. Sounds like fun. But we'll be uh, probably exploring this place next episode. After we get this treasure, of course. Golden Inca Vessel. Uh, it's another one of those guys. <laughs> so I will see you then. Thanks for watching.